Hello guys and welcome back to TechWolf and welcome back to this command line course. As from previous tutorials we know now how to navigate the file system, we will learn another command how to see what is in folders which we navigate to. As you remember from previous tutorials I will click on my file explorer and here on the left hand side if we navigate to the very bottom we will see this PC, click into this PC and here is your C drive, you might how like I mentioned more than one drive on your PC and in those drives is all information about your computer. In my scenario I have only one drive which is C drive and all information about this computer is in this one drive. If we click into it we will find here also users folder and if we click into this users folder we will find here all users which are on your computer. In my scenario you can see that I have only one user which is Marty folder and all my information about me, all my desktop, all my downloads are in this one folder. If I click on into it, you can see I have my desktop, documents, downloads and so on and so forth, all other information which I can access from this computer. However, as I am administrative user, I can access pretty much everything on this computer. So now let's open a command prompt. In search type in CMD or you could type command prompt and click on this system icon command prompt and let's open our command prompt. As you remember from previous tutorials, we learned that we are in C drive, we are in users, as you can see here, we are in users folder and whenever we are opening command prompt, we are in our users directory by default and we have this blinking cursor which tells us that we can start executing and this is exactly where we are here. If we click on top navigation, you can see that we are in C drive we are in users directory and I am now in my Marty directory. This is my users directory in your scenario that will be your usernames. By clicking in that folder, you will be able to see all your information. But now, for example, in previous tutorials, we learned that we can navigate by using CD command. If we would want to navigate to our desktop, we can easily do it by typing cd or change directory and typing in desktop and hitting enter. And now as you can see I have navigated from users Marty to desktop. This means that now I am in this in my desktop directory where I can see all files which are here on my desktop which is images and Cisco packet tracer. If I open now back command prompt we can use another command which is dir command and dir command allows us to see what is in in that particular directory which we are in and that is the directory which is the very last in this path where we have navigated to. In this scenario we have navigated to users, Marty and desktop. So this means that we are in desktop directory and if we would want to see what is in this directory or in this folder we simply type in command dir and we hit enter and here we can see all folders and all files which are here on my desktop. If I would want to see the wide view of these directories I could also type another command which is dir space forward slash and capital W and hit enter and I would get exactly the same output but let's say that I will go into my desktop and I will create another folder here and I will call it let's say I will right click I will select new and I will select on folder and I will create a new folder and I will call it my folder and I will save it here so now we have another folder on our desktop so let's open a command prompt now before I continue I will clean this screen as you remember we can do it by command CLS and hit enter and this will simply clean the screen it will it is not deleting anything it is simply cleaning our command prompt and now I will type in dir or directory to see what is on our desktop and hit enter and now you will also see that I have another directory here which is my folder as you see I have a directory which is my folder which is this one on my desktop and I have also a directory or folder which is called images which is this one in our scenario and I have other two files which is for Cisco packet tracer as you can see here actually I will change the name of my folder as I wrote it incorrectly so my folder folder and hit enter so this name is correct and now again I can type it dir to check if it's 
uh, it, if it has changed and you can see that my folder name is also changed here but now I will open this folder on my desktop and in this folder I will create another file and to create a file you right click somewhere you hover over new and select to create a text document in my scenario I will click on this text document and here I will type that this text document will be my file you can call it however you want. I just want to demonstrate you how you can navigate by CD command, which we have learned in previous tutorial and how you can see what is in these folders and files. So CD command is for navigation. So again, let's clean everything so we can clearly see what is on our command prompt screen. And let's type in dir to see what is now in this desktop. And now in this desktop, we can see that we have these two directories and we have also this directory, which is my folder so now let's navigate to that my folder by typing command change directory or cd space and my folder and hit enter and now we have navigated to users marty desktop and to my folder and now if we want to see what is in this my folder we also type in a command dir and hit enter we can see that in this folder where we are located currently there is also created this myfile.txt file which we just created and which we located in this my folder which is here and as you can see the main use case for dir or directory command is to see what is in those folders or in there where we have navigated to and now if we would want to go back to my marty directory I can also do so by typing cd or change directory space then c column backslash users backslash marty and hitting enter and as you can see i have navigated back to my marty directory and this is my main directory where like i mentioned you are getting opened by default whenever you are coming into the when, whenever you are opening a command prompt this is your default directory if you click on user navigation or graphical user interface you click on this pc you click into this c drive click into users directory and click into your marty or your username directory and you will be able to see all your folders and all your files and to see now all my folders and all my files i simply type in a command dir or directory and hit enter and as you can see there is this all the same folders and files which are located here in my directory where is my desktop where is my apps where is my contacts where is my downloads and all other directories and files which are located here so yes guys this is how you can use dir command so cd command is for navigating the file system to getting from from one place to another and by using a dir command you can see what is in that particular file or folder where you have navigated to mm -hmm.